Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to Morals and Minutes. I am Muhammad Ali and today we will talk about the realm of Islam. We constantly hear from people in the markets and gatherings etc. Statements such as, hey, did you hear about Hussein? I heard he did such and such a thing. Or, hey, make sure you don't visit this guy anymore. He had such and such faults because X and Y taught me. And so on. This is the result of not practicing the religion in all its concern, backbiting, speaking of others in ill martyrs and exposing one another faults is not in the realm of Islam. The viewer may ask and wonder, why? Well, Islam places a high emphasis on keeping a believer's secret within yourself and not sharing it with the public. The Quran and the Holy Sunnah encourages brothers to be merciful with one another and safeguard each other's backs and keep each other's secrets. Let us look at some of these traditions of the Holy Messenger, peace be upon him, and his family, and his progeny, peace be upon them. It is narrated by al Alam al Majlisi in his Bihar al Anwar on the authority of Imam Abu Ja'far al Baqir, peace be upon him, he said. It is compulsory for every Muslim to conceal even 70 great faults of his fellow Muslim. This is because as for true brotherhood, sisterhood to be accomplished, we have to follow these teachings because other traditions tell us that if you have a problem with your believing brother, you must go to him and tell it to him in secrecy and not cause him shame and harm him in the community. The Imam peace be upon him also said it is compulsory meaning he is informing his followers that these are the akhlaq, teachings and etiquette of the believing Muslims, believing Shia. Last but not least, I will conclude with the words of eloquence from the Prince of Believers, Imam Ali, peace be upon him. He says, accept the apology from your Muslim brother, and if he has not any, invent one for him yourself. Golden words from our Master, Ali, peace be upon him. This is the religion of mercy kindness, brotherhood, sisterhood. This is the religion of Allah. Let us be the proof and reason for these golden words by practicing it in our daily life. May peace and blessing be upon Muhammad and his holy progeny. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.